What is DHCP Superscope? DHCP Superscope is a collection of individual scopes that are grouped together for administrative purposes. This configuration allows client computers to receive an IP address from multiple logical subnets even when the clients are located on the same physical subnet. How to configure DHCP Superscope? Go to Server Manager. Click Add Roles and Feature. Click Next. Select Role Based and Feature Based Installation then click Next. Click Next. Select DHCP Server. Click Add Feature. Click Next. Click Next. Click Next. Click Restart the destination server automatically if required. Click on Yes. Click Install. It will take some time to install Role. Click Complete DHCP Configuration. Click Next. Click on Commit. Click on Close. Click Tools. Click DHCP. I am going to create scope. Right click IPv4 and click new scope. Click next. Provide a name and description to new scope and click next. Provide an IP address range, start IP address and end IP address. Click Next. Add IP address you want to exclude from scope, if any. In my case I am exclude particular range because I want create super cope in different class range. Click Next. Set the lease duration, default is 8 days. I am increase the lease duration in triple 9 days. Click Next. Choose Yes, I will configure these options now and click Next. Add router IP then click Next. Fill domain name and server name. Click Next. Fill server name. Click Next. Choose Yes, I want to activate this scope now. Click Next. Click on Finish. My scope is configure. Now I am going to create new super scope. Right click the IPv4, and then click new super scope. Click Next. Fill Super Scope Name Example Super 1. Click Next. Select Available Scope then click Next. Click on Next then click Finish. Right click on Super Scope. Select New Scope. Click Next. Fill name and description. Click Next. Provide an IP address range, start IP address and end IP address. 
I am using class B IP address range, start IP range is 172.16.0.1. And IP range is 172.16.0.255, click next. Add IP address you want to exclude from scope, if any. Click next. I am increase the lease duration in triple nine days. Click next. Choose yes, I will configure these options now and click next. Fill router IP address is 110.0.0.1. Click next. Fill domain name and server name. Click next. Fill server name. Click next. Choose yes, I want to activate this scope now. Click next. Click on finish. My super scope is configure. Go to client machine. Go to Ethernet properties. Select TCP IP and select properties. Select obtain IP address automatically. Select obtain DNS server address automatically. Click OK and close. Go to run. Type command. Type IP config then press enter. This IP showing on my first scope. Go to another client machine. Go to run. Type ncpa.cpl then press enter. Go to Ethernet properties. Select TCP IP and select properties. Select obtain IP address automatically. Select obtain DNS server address automatically. Click OK and close. Go to run. Type command. Type IP config then press enter. This IP show in my second scope. It means my super scope configure successfully. Go to server and check IP lease. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.